Bob Blackman. Thank you, Mr. Deputy Speaker. And I would like to congratulate my honourable friend for the excellent work she's done in supporting students and universities across this very difficult period. Clearly, students are now consumers, consumers en enabled to demand the best from their universities. And the key point here is getting value for money. And I, I know that my honourable friend is trying to do that. Can she also elucidate the position in relation to um, international students? Many universities are wholly dependent now on the income from international students. What advice is being given to those students who are equally consumers of our education? Thank you, Mr Deputy Speaker. The Government's expectations are very clear that universities should maintain the quality, quantity and accessibility of provision. And if a student is unhappy, whether they are international or domestic, then they can utilise the OFS notifications procedure to preempt a review or they can make a formal complaint to their university. If they're still unsatisfied with that, they can go to the OIA, which can and has led to fee refunds in the past.